Hey everyone, it's Nicholas, Presence of God Ministry. Website is remnantofgod.org. Uh, you might want to scroll down to the third article in the headline section today. It's uh, titled "Sister Wives Wins," or yeah, "Sister Wives Family Wins Ruling in Bigamy Suit." I already got the article tabbed out. It's from the Miami Herald, and I'm going to read the first sentence. It says a federal judge ruled Friday that key parts of Utah's polygamy laws are unconstitutional handing a legal victory to a polygamous family that stars in the TV reality show Sister Wives. And if you've been frequently uh, or frequenting the uh, you know, remedygod.org website, you know that I've been talking about this for years, um, and I did a radio broadcast in 2004 about this, and uh, a newsletter as well, in regards to um, how they have to legalize, you know, I mean, as soon as they legalize homosexual marriage, they're going to have to move ahead on legalizing polygamy. I mean, we also stated, though, on, on the website and, and the um, radio and all that stuff that they actually want to legalize pedophilia first because of Rome's multi-million dollar lawsuits are getting to them. Uh, and legalizing pedophilia will make the Roman priests appear more moral in society's eyes since it's legal, right? Uh, but you know, society isn't ready for that yet. I mean, they're not they just not ready to legalize child molestation yet. So... They have to first legalize homosexual marriage, and they've done that, and then polygamy. And now we're seeing doing just that. I mean, we've, we've seen it all along, like with all the articles that I've been sharing, how they're pushing here and pushing there all over the place to try to get polygamy legalized. Uh, but it wasn't until we saw this federal judge here going ahead with it and helping out some polygamists. So uh, that's why I figured I'd put up the, the video today. But I think it's just so amazing to see how God's people— because they stay in his word and they stay on their knees and they stay in his omnipotent will that they're blessed with being able to see this stuff coming. I mean, with eternal blessings like that, it's a wonder to me as to why there aren't more obedient Christians in the world today. But then that too was prophesied. And what I mean is just go to remedygod.org and uh, scroll down to the prophecy section and go down to soon fulfilled and go down to the bottom where it says 144,000 will bring you to this page here. On the bottom, I actually did a uh, sermon series a while back on this. Uh, the Gideon Band, uh, we like to refer to them as, or the 144,000. And if you want some additional information as to what the Old and New Testament says about homosexuality and how it's wrong and sinful, and you also want some information as to why homosexual uh, uh, marriage is legal now, it has to do with the lukewarm Christians. It's their fault. And uh, so just go to YouTube and type in homosexual marriage. Uh, with a question mark and you'll come to my video so anyway this the reason i did the video today was to get that out there in regards to that polygamous situation so uh, please subscribe um, please share the video with as many as you possibly can and again thank you for watching god bless